you guys, don't mind me. <laughs> no makeup, I just woke up. But, I don't know, I figured I would make this video because, um, I know there's uh, other moms that suffer from this and I know they feel alone and stuff, but I just wanted to let you know, like, postpartum hair loss isn't a joke. Like, look at that. And it goes, like, all the way around. Like, I have, like, a receding hairline. There's, like, tanner right there, but, um... Um, little guy, Sebastian just turned four months the other day, so, I mean, this is, like, normal for, um, women to lose their hair, like, three to four months of postpartum, but I'm gonna, see, my hair is, like, not tight, like, it's loose, so I'm not pulling on it, so I've been wearing my hair up like this for, like, you know, like, days and stuff like that, and I only wash it once a week, and I'm about to wash it, like, now, but... You know, I like pull down these hairs right here to like mask it, but um, so I'm gonna go ahead and brush my hair and then I'll show you guys like just how much comes out, like it's crazy. Okay, so I'll be right back. So my brush is pretty clean, so you yeah, know, I'm just gonna take my hair down and brush it out. It was so thick and so long. You have no idea. <laughs> I've loved it. Like, seriously, my hair isn't really thick anyways, like, naturally. So, just losing all this hair, I'm kind of like, okay, like, I can say goodbye to the nice hair, nice thick hair, and get back to my, um, thin hair. See, um, like, right here, my hair was, like, bleached, but that was probably about, it was, like, two years ago. Yeah, how in shape I was. <laughs> I'll get back to that soon, but yeah, my hair is like not really thick at all. So, um, yeah, it's pretty knotty, I guess. But I just want to show you guys like just how much comes out in my brush. Like, it's crazy. Like, I've been clogging the drains and everything. But, um, your hair sheds so much after pregnancy because. Um, your hormones and stuff when you're pregnant, something, um, I don't remember the technical medical words for it, but your hair doesn't go through the regular shedding process that it does when you're not pregnant. So the hairs that are supposed to shed out stay put, so that gives you like nice thick hair. So after around three to four months postpartum, those hairs um, start going through that shedding phase that they were supposed to go through. So. A lot more than normal comes out. Okay, so I'm gonna put this down so I can comb the rest of it and I'll show you guys how much came out. Okay, so I just did like that side. So my hair, I haven't flipped my hair over and done the other side yet, but um, isn't that crazy? Alright, so I'm gonna do the other side. I always forget to record in landscape when I'm videos on my phone sorry so most of this is gonna be vertical so I'm sorry about that but isn't that crazy yeah that's like my whole head completely brushed out probably like oh my god please stop brushing <laughs> but you know it is what it is my hair will stop falling out eventually like I'm not gonna go bald insane it's like every single time I brush my hair and you saw how I had my hair just like in a loose bun <laughs> like I haven't been wearing it in like a tight ponytail or anything but that's insane like I just got I don't know if it's still in the trash but yeah it is this was last night like I just brushed it real quick that which isn't that bad but um yeah I haven't been overly brushing but isn't that insane? Anyway, so 
many of you are going through the same thing, you're not alone. It's happening to me too. <laughs> and I will get through this. Yeah, I need to um, highlight my hair and do my roots. And it's just like, God, I just don't want to mess up my hair, but look how bad that looks. Anyways, you guys, you're not alone. Postpartum hair loss is a B-I-T-C-H, but we'll get through it. 